So this is Azrael's enclosure. Pretty much how it works is vines are suction cupped to the glass. And then plants are like zip tied to all of all of the vine. And there he is right there. Feeding cup in the middle. The, the way the vine is set up is kind of snug where it sits in there and it just tucks in. I have some small crickets and I have this male cricket. He's been eating adult crickets lately. So I try to... I gotta call the male crickets out of here because they chirp and I can't deal with that. So He's already eaten three and he's got a couple of, I guess, half inch, quarter inch crickets, however you want to say. Uh, decent misting daily. Uh, three or four per day. Uh, I have paper towel on the bottom. It soaks up some of the misting. You can see it damp right here, kind of keeps the humidity. And then it dries throughout the day. It dries in between misting, so this will be completely dry in about two hours. Uh, I have a drip cup. It's got a piece of plant hanging into it, so if he ever falls in, he could climb out of this. Uh, little dripper. I velcroed it to the cage. You can't see it, but uh, velcroed it to the cage so it doesn't really move around too much. Uh, Repti Sun 5 0 bulb. And then uh, a dome light. It was open, but I, um, I get already with foil to keep the heat in. I made openings to kind of regulate the heat. If I close it, it ch each one of these cubes that I, if I were to close it right now, would be one to two degrees at its basking spot. And temperature gauges. And that's pretty much it. Uh, I mean, it keeps the humidity great. I love this Exoterra Viv, so. it. This guy actually, I hand missed because I don't want to put a Miss King on it because it's just, it'll soak the whole thing. So, let me make sure just I'm not up doing this. I don't even use this for him drinking. He never, he drinks off the leaves, but he usually drinks at this spot right here where the dripper is. Let me see if I could turn on so you can see. So it'll drip right in this little area right here, and that's usually where he, that's why he's hanging out here pretty much, I guess. And then you can see it dripping into the, into the bowl at the bottom. Some overspray, the paper towel will catch it. Usually it's not this fast of a drip, it's one to two drips per second. So let me slow it down to what it usually is supposed to be. It'll be more like this throughout the day. And if I were to fill this up, uh, that will be three, four hours of dripping. So two of these per day, and that lasts him throughout the day. If he ever needs to drink, he has access to water. And this way there's no drowning. I've had, I haven't had any issues with him even getting even close to where this thing is to even have a drowning risk. But that's it. Hope you like it. Thank you.